Hi everyone, Assalamu Alaikum. Good morning, good evening, wherever you are. This is Shaila Anjum. Today I am going to talk to you about Amazon KDP paperback books. And this is the second video of this series. In my first video, I discussed about what Amazon KDP is, how many genres are available, why Amazon KDP is important, how can we use Amazon KDP platform to publish paperback and e-books. And today we will talk about how to work inside the Amazon KDP platform. So if you think you want to know uh, how to work inside Amazon KDP, then this is for you this video is for you so let's get started let's go to the Amazon website and if you find the sign in section you know how to sign in and after you sign in you can be on the next page and uh, on this page you're going to click paperback and you click this section and you go to uh, the next page that says um, to complete these three steps and uh, these three steps are actually important as we have discussed before uh, each step needs to be completed uh, before we go to the next step so the first tab says you need to select the language uh, this is uh, um, the language of your book in which language you want your book to be published I am selecting English and the next step is the book title of your book it can be any it's up to you um, uh, which title you like to choose but there is a whole procedure behind that process uh, and I will be showing you that process when I discuss about the keywords of the book so title is actually a keyword and uh, when you um, select uh, title of the book it's important because you cannot uh, change the title of the book once your book is live uh, yes so I'm saying that because when your book is live you still have some time to change a uh, few things you can come back and edit few things but uh, the title of the book is the one that cannot be changed so it's uh, very important that when you select a title, it is very well chosen. The subtitle is optional. It's up to you. You can uh, make your book powerful. Uh, if you want to do that, you can choose it. Then is next thing is series. If you're writing series, this is also an optional part. Uh, if uh, your writing has series, then you choose that. Otherwise, you just more for the next option it's about about edition uh, like I, when I wrote my first book it was a first edition so I put number one in this section um, yeah and then the next part is author author is uh, mm, it can be you or uh, uh, it can be your pen name whatever you like and the next part is contributor contributors are editors, uh, illustrators, translators, and co-writers, co-authors. Uh, you can mention their names. You can also add uh, another section to mention each name separately, which is beautiful. And this part is about the description of the book. It uh, matters a lot because the first thing that your customers uh, would be able to see uh, clearly is the description of the book like when people are on the bookshop and they are uh, shopping or they're looking at a book the first thing they look at is the description 
and then they can look inside and the next thing is about the publishing rights and Amazon gives you a choice that you can choose your copyright and you can choose that you have the whole uh, all, all the copyrights you have all the copyrights or you can mention that this is a public domain work so it's up to you so this is the part that I was talking about uh, it is uh, it has the same importance as the title of the book so it should be related to the title and uh, I will be making a separate video about the procedure of how to choose a title of your book and the keywords so people can find your book easily and it's very very important uh, so next part is about the categories of the book you have choice like we talked about the generals uh, in in the last video and uh, um, it depends uh, which genre you are following for your writing. It can be any, but Amazon wants you, you to choose two categories that describe your book. And uh, the next part is about the uh, adult content. You need to mention it if uh, your writing has that content or not and once you're done uh, you can save and go to the next step save and continue but if you think that you are not done you can save as a draft and uh, uh, today oh, we are just uh, finishing here um, in the next video we will go to the next step after we actually complete this these uh, details and then I will show you how we can go to the next step uh, after uh, filling all these parts so if you have any questions about uh, uh, today's uh, um, video or if you have any comments please um, go to the comment section below and uh, do comment there if you like this video um, like it subscribe it and share it with others thank you